Hello again, everybody. This Saturday night at 8, UofL football opens its 2022 season at Syracuse, a pivotal fall in the fourth year under head coach Scott Satterfield coming off back-to-back -back losing seasons. Satterfield had his pregame news conference today, and WLKY's Dominic Gates was there. Well, the offseason talk is officially over. It is now game week for Louisville football. The Cardinals travel to Syracuse to take on the Orange Saturday night. This is the first time since 2014 the Cardinals have opened up the season against the conference opponent, which has made this offseason much more intense. We wanted to be physical. We wanted to have a, a tough mindset. And for us, starting this season off with an ACC opponent, you better be ready to go. Scott Satterfield and the Cardinals take a three-game win streak against Syracuse heading into the Dome. But the team is currently riding a two-game losing streak dating back to last year's 6-7 and seven campaign. Syracuse returns key pieces from last year's five-win team, including one of the league's best running backs in Sean Tucker and quarterback Garrett Schrader. We just have to do a great job of game tackling Sean. I mean, because he's an explosive runner. I mean, one of the best in ACC, uh, one of the best in the country. Uh, so we can continue to do that and win up front and win in the trenches uh, and get our linebackers in the backfield. I think we'll have a pretty good day. On paper, this is Satterfield's deepest team in his four years at UofL. With experienced players and impact transfers, they're preparing for a tough, yet critical start to the season. To go on the road and get an AC a conference win, uh, <laughs> it'd be big time. That's what we're, that was what we're shooting for. Um, you know, and then, you know, you got a six-day turnaround to go to Central Florida, another hostile environment, albeit not a conference game, but a huge game. Um, you know, you, you, you have to start off on a good note. The good news for Louisville football is Scott Satterfield confirmed on Tuesday the team is completely healthy and ready to go when they take on Syracuse in the Dome. I'm Dominique Yates, WLKY Sports.